So this is going to make me sound really, really unprofessional. We released a new major version of this software, and the first thing it did when people opened their existing query files was to corrupt them and stop them from working. So the support chap came to me and said, the new software has fucked the med files. And I went, so you want me to write something to unfuck the med files? And he said, yes. And so I booted up Visual Basic 6, and you know, the two hardest problems in software, naming things and cache invalidation, I'll call it the med file unfucker. I'll think of a proper name before we release it. <laughs> Once I'd done that, I kind of rolled with it. So the dialog box that it popped up said med file unfucker in the title bar, and then it had a file selection button that said, choose file to unfuck. <laughs> and then when you'd chosen it, it just had a big button that said, unfuck now. <laughs> and when it had finished, it said, file unfucked successfully. And I gave it to Chris, and I said, can you just test that, make sure it works, and then I'll sort of make it right for releasing to the customer. And then I didn't hear back from him, because Chris released it. Because of course he did. He released it to all our customers. I don't think I did very well in my annual review that year. <laughs>